Thanks for tuning in to the show. I sell loads of vintage gold. Now let's go see what's sold. This is the Polaroid Automatic 250 Land Camera. It's got the bellows and the viewfinder up here. And it's got the front case with the cold clip. This camera sold for $66.39 plus shipping. The buyer's all in at $91.20. Here's a 1922 copy of the best tales of Edgar Allan Poe. Sold for $35 plus shipping. Buyer's all in for a total of $40.30. Here's a Columbia made in the USA fishing shirt, XXL, long sleeve, it's got a ton of pockets. It's sold for $27.99 plus shipping for a total of $36.44. This is a pair of BMX bike pegs, sold for $9.99 plus shipping, buyers all in at $18.39. These two items sold to the same buyer. On the left, we have a ceramic ashtray from Oklahoma. And on the right, we have a fortune shaker game with a leather case. Together, the two items sold for $30 plus shipping for a total of $45.74. Here's an Abercrombie & Fitch lined muscle flannel. Size XXL. This sold for $28 plus tax and shipping for a total of $35.75. Here's an Innova Golf Disc Pro Boss Distance Driver. Sold for $12. Buyers all in at $17.81. This is a 1909 printing of Silas. Sold for $9.99 plus tax and shipping. The buyers all in at $14.36. We have a Briggs and Stratton painter's cap, sold for $19.99 plus tax and shipping. The buyer's all in at $27.15. Here's a rain stick, about 19 inches long, made out of cactus. It's got a rainbow yarn around it. And it sold for $22.39 plus shipping for a total of $32.29. This is a vintage John Surrey tobacco pipe made of briar wood. Sold for $27.99 plus shipping for a total of $35.35. Sold this John Sebastian Blues harmonica book. Sold for $7.99 plus shipping. Buyers all in at $11.45. I took an offer on this black leather briefcase. It's unbranded. Sold for $30.05. Buyer paid a total of $52.06. This is a patch from the brass ass of Cripple Creek. Sold for $10 plus shipping. Buyers all in at $13.80. This is an Urton Deluxe automatic numbering machine stamp. Somebody picked this up for $19 plus shipping for a total of $27.40. This is a Robo knife sharpener with box and instructions. It's sold for $10.39 plus shipping. For a total of $16.72. I took an offer on this lot of three putt and approach golf discs. They went for $22 plus shipping for a total of $35.61. Somebody bought this Sears Craftsman 25 foot measuring tape. It sold for $7.99 plus shipping for a total of $16.00. 94. Printed in 1928, 
This is the first step, how to play the Hawaiian steel guitar. Instructional book, sold for $17.59 plus shipping. Buyer paid a total of $20.39. Here's a Pantera reinventing the steel sticker. It went for $7.99 plus shipping. Buyer paid a total of $12.93. Here's an 11 inch Premier Pro softball glove by Mizuno. Somebody picked this up for $19.50 plus shipping for a total of $27.90. Here's a partially full sample vial of Quelquez perfume. Sold for $6 plus shipping for a total of $10.05. I took an offer on this Stevie Ray Vaughan Texas Flood guitar songbook. Buyer paid $9.99 plus shipping. All in at $13.59. Here's a pair of hand carved buffalo made from granite. Sold for $18 plus shipping for a total of $26. Okay, we've got a jumbo folding knife. It depicts the Battle of Gettysburg in the Civil War. It's even got a stand in the box. This sold for $15.99 plus shipping. Buyer paid a total of $31.17. Here's a pair of foldable Ferrari sunglasses with pleather case. It's kind of hard to see, but the lenses are very crackled. So I sold them for $9.99 plus shipping. Buyer paid a total of sixteen oh two. Here's a nineteen eighty eight copy of the Fender Stratocaster book. Sold for eighteen dollars plus shipping for a total of twenty two sixty five. Here's a Star Wars Empire Stripes Back giant photo card. Sold for five dollars plus shipping for a total of ten forty six. Here's a couple of vintage songbooks going out to the same buyer. They paid $12.99 plus shipping for a total of $16.90. This is a heavy duty brass bottle opener. It's about six inches long. It's got the African mask. Sold for $29.99 plus shipping for a total of $37.61. We've got this unbranded hand tooled leather belt. It's got this horse motif pretty distressed belt but it sold for $18 plus shipping for a total of $28.80 sold this vintage Bobette bait box just half a turn and there's your worm sold for $13 plus shipping for a total of $22.42 we've got a pair of born leather sandals size 9 sold for $22 plus shipping for a total of 30, 40. This is a 1940 copy of Indians of Yesterday. Sold for $10 plus shipping. Buyers all in at $14.06. We've got a tooled and painted women's leather belt from The Gap. Somebody bought this for $14 plus shipping. Buyers all in at $23.55. This is a 1985 printing of History of Art, second edition textbook. It sold for $19.99 plus shipping for a total of $25.97. This is a vintage paper copy advancer made by Right Line. Somebody picked this up for $17 plus shipping for a total of $32.27. This is a partially full sample vial of Fahrenheit perfume. It went for $19.99 plus shipping for a total of $25.43. Here's a Coors Light Silver Bullet Racing trucker cap. It's got the mesh back, snap back, some pretty heavy wear. There's even a crease in the bill. But it still sold for $44.99 plus shipping for a total of 
Thanks again.